Hello everyone, thank you for watching my video. Today I would like to make a review about the camera of my new phone, Pixel 3a XL. The camera on the phone is really amazing. It is by far the best phone camera I have ever had. My last phone was FG V20 and Samsung Galaxy S6, which are also have a decent camera. I would like to list what I like and don't like about the camera on Pixel 3a XL. The photos and video used in this review are straight out of camera without any editing. One of the favorite features in this phone camera is the night mode or the night sight. I use the night mode for taking most of the photo with this phone because the photo looks better with great dynamic range and the white balance is more accurate than regular camera mode. Even though it is during the daytime, I still use the night mode. The night mode photo looks very vibrant in color and very sharp. It looks like it is already edited, so it saves my time editing the photo. The downside of night mode is you cannot save the file in RAW if you're using night mode. But it's not a bit D for me because I really shoot with RAW in this phone. Another great feature of this camera is the stabilization while taking video. It is by far the best video stabilization I ever seen in any of the smartphone I ever have. Even though I was just holding with my hand and walking, it seems like I use a gimbal to take this video. It looks pretty smooth and look very professional. The image stabilization is also work amazingly while taking a photo. When I take this photo, the flower is keep moving because of the wind blowing, but it still can give me a very sharp photo. Okay, let's dive into the camera menu.
One of the complaints that I have about this camera is that when I switch from camera mode to video mode, the view is become two time zoom. I'm very surprised to find that this camera doesn't come with any of the optical zoom or the wide angle lens. A selfie, the selfie in this phone will not be very wide. The camera has the digital zoom up to five times. Up to two times, the image quality is pretty acceptable. Thank you for watching my video. I hope this video is useful for those who want to buy this phone. And I would like to say that after using this for a few days, 
I really enjoy using this phone and the camera is pretty good for the price. I hope you enjoy my video. If you, if you do, please leave a comment, subscribe my channel or give me a thumbs up. Thank you. I will see you in the next video.